Argos, man. Everybody want to know where you been at, buddy. They want to know what you been up to. I heard that they got me on a tight leash, but I'm a big dog like Argos. Yeah, Bobby in the lead, what are you talking about? Cooking Chef T, what are you talking about? Told me that the beef were healthy, so we went green, what are you talking about? Bobby in the lead, what are you talking about? Cooking Chef T, what are you talking about? Yo. It's your boy Tyrell. And we got Argos down here. What's up, my boy? What's up, Argos? Tell the people what's up, man. Look at him. Ah. So, guys, first and foremost, I know it's been a while. I know it's been a few weeks since I last posted. I'm going to be updating you guys on everything. You'll be getting an update on me an update on Argos uh, throughout this video. I'm back, you know what I'm saying? We're gonna be vlogging. I've been getting endless amount of DMs on Instagram asking when I'm posting again, and comments on my videos. I just needed a little break, man, you know what I mean? If I don't post on YouTube, that doesn't mean I'm not active like posting on my Instagram story or my Snapchat story. That's why you guys should be following me. If you guys follow me on Twitter, you follow me on Instagram, and you follow me on Snapchat, you see all the updates, you see what's going on and things like that. Also, if you're watching this video right now, be sure to subscribe. Today we got a pretty, pretty busy day. Me and Argos, he's over there on my bed right now. He just turned 10 months yesterday. Today is Monday. Um, on Sunday, he turned 10 months, and I got a little clip I'm gonna be showing you guys. So I do a tradition. If you guys been following me for a while, you already know about the tradition me and Argos do every month until his one year birthday. Ain't that right, buddy? Don't mind my feet. You guys see my feet. <laughs> look at this guy. And since he's putting his paw up here, look at his nails, guys. That's one thing we're gonna do today. We're gonna take him to get his nails cut today. He looks like an eagle, man. Look how long these are. I called in and I wanted to get the same lady that always does it, and she's not gonna be there until Wednesday. So that I'd have to wait two days to get his nails clipped, which they need to be done ASAP, man, because they're so sharp. So we're gonna do that today. And right now, actually, I'm gonna get ready to go to the post office. I have a subscriber that sent something in and they sent me the confirmation that is already there. So I'm gonna go ahead and go pick that up probably in the next few minutes or so. If you wanna send something in to me and Argos, the PO box is in the description. Me and Argos are very grateful for you guys that sent things in. If you can't send anything in, but you would like to support me and Argos, there's also a donation link in the description and is in my about tab for my channel. Donations aren't required. I just got it there um, simply because I had a few people um, you know, they said that they couldn't send anything in, but they would like to get Argo some treats or something. And I pretty much made that, um, you know, that donation link available. Probably gonna be a longer video because I wanna catch you guys up on a lot of things. And I'm gonna show you guys my day, pretty much what I'm gonna be doing. Right now, I'm gonna go ahead and head to the post office. Argos is gonna stay here because it is actually raining. And actually, I need to pick up some food for Argos. And before you guys ask, before you guys say, what do you feed Argos? I made a video on it already. Um, the title of it is, what do I feed my puppy? Go ahead and go check it out. That'll answer your question before you guys even ask, but that's just something I have to do. See, it's still raining. All right, guys. Got the package. That's the P.O. box for you guys that's wondering. Gotta stop by the grocery store. All right, guys. Just left Wegmans. This is where I'm at right now. I don't know if you guys can hear this rain, man. It's raining pretty crazy today. And uh, I expected it to stop. And then, you know, I take Argos to get his nails clipped, man. But it's raining so hard. It's not a good day right now, man. But I got some groceries. There's definitely something in here that I want to show you guys in another video, like a little uh, vegan dessert, vegan snack kind of thing. I'm gonna show you guys that in another video. I need to stop and get Argos food and then I'm gonna head home. But the store is literally like one or two minutes from my house. Wagmans is actually like 15, 20 minutes from me. The store I get Argos food from is like literally two minutes from my house. So I'm gonna stop by there on the way home get Argos food, and then yeah, I'm gonna get you guys updated to some stuff, man. Argos is going through a phase, let's just say that. I'm gonna show you guys what I mean when I get home. Y'all stay tuned. <sighs> Look, I, 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 no, 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 no. All right, guys, look at this. I was gonna say it a surprise for you guys. Yep. No, 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 down, Argos down. 
No, 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 no. Sit. Stay. I was going to say the surprise for you guys, man. He didn't just do this. This All this stuff was in the trash because he did this um, over the weekend, man. I was going to leave. I left it in the trash to show you guys. And I guess he got into the trash while I was gone. And, um, yeah, this is what he did. Argos, what do you got to say about this, man? What is this? What happened? Argos? Look at him. Argos, what happened? What, what did you do? What did you do? What happened? What happened, man? What happened right here? So he destroyed my blinds, guys. So I had to take my blinds down. There's no blinds here anymore. And then... See this wood right here? Oh, yeah. Chewed all that up. Show you guys. Look at this. Look at that. It's my window sill, right? Chewed it up. And then I come back to this. And he's trying to hide over there now. So this is one of the phases, the good, the bad, the ugly that I was referring to earlier in the video. Argos has been destroying everything. He's going through this phase where he's just, he destroyed my blinds. You guys saw that. He didn't just do this. Like he didn't just destroy my blinds. All this, the scraps that you saw all over the floor, that was in my trash can. I was going to show you guys that. I was going to, you know, show you guys this part, the window and everything. Like actually when I got back in, crazy enough, he laid it out for me. A few videos ago, I told you guys, since he's getting older, I want him to stay out of the kennel when I leave, right? And my way of doing that is I will leave for a few minutes or whatever, and I will come back. And he wasn't messing with anything for like a few weeks. So I'm like, okay, good. And recently, man, he's just like, when I leave and I come back, he's been messing with everything. And of course I tell him, no, you're not supposed to do that. No, no. He knows and he'll walk away. Kind of like what he's doing right now. He'd be over there, you know? So I tried again while I left. I went to the post office. I went to the grocery store, things like that, just to see how he'd do. And I come back and he got into this stuff again. So, you know, we got to kind of restart, redo everything, man. Let me know, what do you guys think, man? I'll leave his toys out. Um, I use his Kong, his peanut butter Kong. I leave that out. I leave treats out, things like that, so he doesn't get um, get into stuff. Me personally, I think it has to do with like separation anxiety, or he just like gets upset when I leave. Maybe, maybe that's the cause to it. I'm not sure, um, but he wasn't always doing this. This was more like recent, like the past like few weeks. He's been doing that. I remember when I first got my puppy. So many people was like, "Yo, man, my puppy like chewed through a wall. My puppy chewed through a couch. He ate my shoe." You know what I'm saying? Like, they used to say this, and I'm like, man, that's crazy, like, because Argos never did this. I'm like, well, I got really lucky. And now, I'm seeing exactly what those people were talking about. Some of you guys are probably, um, you know, wondering, am I mad? No, I'm not mad, um, but I have to let Argos know that I'm upset that he did this. I'm not gonna be like, oh, hey, buddy, like, you know, start like, that's why when he came to me and he tried to jump on me and greet me, I, I, I completely ignored that because there's a bigger problem at hand. Me knowing that he's going through this phase and me leaving him out, I can't really get mad because it was my way of testing him to see how he's gonna do. Since he's only 10 months, he's not like matured yet. I'm hoping it's just a phase, man. So you guys let me know um, down in the comments. Right now it's about two o'clock. His appointment is in 30 minutes. So I'm gonna go ahead and chill for a little bit, clean this mess up. And then uh, I'm going to go ahead and take him to get his nails cut, man. A few moments later. Look at this big boy. It's a big boy. Where you going, man? Come on, let's go. Let's get in the car. In the car, come on. hoping everything goes good man it's gonna be a different lady and i know argos he gets so excited when there's other dogs or other people around i've seen people in the comments they're like man i, I take my dog to get his, their nails cut like every two or three months i'm like yo i have to take him like every month because his nails grow so fast but anyways i'll see you guys when we get there y'all stay tuned are we here man 
Oh my god, that's awesome. Hey, well. <laughs> Don't get your uh, report. <laughs> yeah, to the no, to the no, 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 no. Hell no, no. He's like, man, oh my gosh. Look at him. All right, guys, as you just saw, man, that was a really, really tough time. That was probably the worst time um, with Argos and the groomer, man. Argos, like, oh, man, he's just, like, just trying to jump off the thing, <laughs> like, the platform. She actually had to call, like, help to, like, kind of hold Argos or hug, like, hug Argos while she cuts his nails or whatever. How you think you did, man? One to ten. How you think you did? Rate yourself. His nails and stuff is all cut now, which is good. Not have to worry about him scratching me anymore or anybody else. And here is my backyard. As you guys know, it's fall. So, got the beautiful leaves coming out here, man. In Virginia, you get to experience all four seasons, man. So, come on, Argos. Let's go. Come on. See, man, he's slimming up a little bit, man. It's probably about the poop. I gotta go green. My brothers is vegan. Leaves keep on changing. That's just the season. Fighting to live as long as I'm breathing. Family need me. I got my reason. Bless for in tears. Believe me, I'm bleeding. Don't think no more. I go on the feeling. Money was slow. Patience was reeling. But we was working while y'all was sleeping. Yeah, but I'm only gonna go if my heart go. Keep my whole life like an art show. All right, guys. We are back inside. Played outside for a little bit. Now I'm gonna open up this package. Let you guys know what it is and who it's from. This is from. Um, Shelly Mirac. Oh man, if I say your last name wrong, I'm sorry. Shelly Miracle. Miracle. Shout out to you, Shelly. <laughs> it's just a shipping order. Oh, buddy, look at this. Oh, oh, okay. I think I see how it works. All right, so look, check this out. What I'm thinking, right? You fill this up with water, and then water comes up to the top, like right here, like a little dog bowl, kind of. You know what? Let's try it out. I'm gonna go ahead and put some water in here. We're gonna try this thing out. All right, so I poured a little bit of water in there. So I guess we squeeze it. Oh, <laughs> that's pretty cool. <laughs> you put water in there. Look, you fill it up like this by squeezing it, right? So it fills up with water. Once he gets a little drink, he doesn't want any more, you let go, and it sucks the rest of the water back in there. That's pretty cool, man. I'm not going to lie. All right, so let's squeeze it. Let me squeeze it. Get the water in there. Oh, it's pretty cool, man. Oh, Argo seems to love it. You like that, buddy? And you just suck it back in there. You fill it up with water. Go ahead and get some. Oh yeah. Argos loves this. Like it, buddy? And then <laughs> Hey Shelly, this is pretty cool and it's definitely gonna be useful, man. Argos, you like it? Oh yeah, he loves it. Look at him. He wants more. So Shelly, shout out to you for sending this in, man. Um this is actually pretty neat. I've never seen nothing like this. It's like a self-filling a self uh, water bottle. Now, right now, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys, you know, the little treat that I got for Argos yesterday um, for his 10 months. Come on. Sit. Oh, buddy, you know you just turned 10 months today, right? You know that? So you know, we got to go ahead and go with our tradition, my boy. 
Yeah, got you a treat, buddy. So look, it's right here is a dog treat. I got him a football because you know today is a football Sunday, man. I know you're excited, buddy. I know. Look at you, even backed up. Good job. Today is a football Sunday, so I actually, you know, I thought it was pretty cool to get him this. Paul. Uh, uh. Paul, good boy. Paul. Uh, that was weak. Hey, Paul, thank you. Speak. Happy 10 months, my boy. 10 months, buddy. Argo's getting so big, guys. I can't believe he's about to be a year old, man. Yeah, guys, please wish Argos a happy 10 months. Just comment down below. He's growing through that teenage phase, man. As you guys saw, he tore up my blinds. He tore up my window. Uh, he's been getting into a lot of stuff lately, man. So the good, the bad, and the ugly. Hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. Uh, I'm going to try to get back to the swing of things, posting uh, weekly. You guys know that I have t-shirts coming. Um, these t-shirts are going to be the first set. They're going to be very limited. I'm going to put pictures of them on the screen right now as I talk. Uh, as you guys see, they're packed up already. I have olive green with the black logo, TF, stands for Tyrell Fry. And then also you will see the black t-shirt with the red outline and the white letters. I decided to go with the swoop bottoms instead of the straight for this particular t-shirt. Um, I think it's going to really be nice, uh, really going to come together like a nice casual shirt, but also you can wear it going out. You can just wear it around the house or whatever. If you're interested, just be on the lookout. Follow me on Instagram. You'll be the first ones to know about anything. But I do have a amazing t-shirt design for when we hit 10K subscribers and it's featuring Argos. It's going to be a really, really dope shirt. I think a lot of you guys are going to enjoy it. So if you're not subscribed to my channel, go ahead and subscribe now. What are you doing? Join the family. But with all that being said, don't forget to like, <laughs> comment, subscribe. Hit that subscribe button. You better hit it too. Also, click the bell so you get a notification anytime I post. <laughs> and I will see y'all Next video. What are you talking about? Bobo in the lead, what are you talking about? Cooking Chef T, what are you talking about? Told me that the beef weren't healthy. So we went green, what are you talking about? What are you talking about?